for the match we're about to see. Anna Lee Waters has led it off for us the last few days. She'll do that again right here, right now. Her opponent is Leia Jansen, the emerging Leia Jansen. Matt, you mentioned that right now Anna Lee, she's in a class by herself, but Leia Jansen, perhaps the biggest threat to the throne. For sure. I mean, she's been playing unbelievable singles since her return to the tour this year, the singles tour, that is. Seconds. Has a win over Anna Lee Waters back in 2021. New in San ball, Clemente, game five one, games. Since then, zero, Anna zero. Lee Waters has been pretty dominant. Only a few losses here and there. This one's going to be a great one. Good start Point. for Anna Lee. Yeah, Leah Jansen's so good, but Anna Lee Waters athletically, I think a little, little bit better power-wise as well, just pure power off that paddle. One zero. Look at our storylines in women's singles. Defending medalists, Annalie Waters won gold here. Mary Brasho won silver here last year. Good Annalie girl. looking for her fifth title in 2024. Point. Brasho losing to Davide. We were wondering if Anna Lee was going to be a little bit rusty coming back to the Carvana PPA Tour. She's answered all those questions. Yeah, answered them <laughs> easily. Playing great in every single discipline. Played lights out with Parento, women's doubles yesterday. She's really the energy force behind her and Ben, or her and ben Johns yesterday. Mixed. Oh, miss at that Point. time. Feels like early on, Annalie just plays at another speed, doesn't it? Five zero. Side out finally to Leah Jansen. Yeah, better for Jansen there. Coming forward, imposing. Again, she's not going to win this match, just running side to side on the baseline, hoping for some good passing Zero shots. Side out. Leia taking home gold at the Houston Open. Also coming back, she got silver at the Red Rock Open in Utah. Second timeout can be called here. Movement. Seven zero. Recovery. Point. And Leia now really trying to press, getting deep returns. Missed a few in a row here. Eight zero. Just keeping her Point. off balance. Yeah, that ball is amazing there from Anna Lee. Dipping it low on that drop and then closing, taking space away immediately right here. A la Federico stacks rude. Very Nine similar zero. in that way. Point. And now game, game point. point for Anna Lee Waters. Don't think we expected this. Hey, zero. Point game, Talk about a statement opening game, Drew. 11 0, 11 on the trot. Can you possibly play any better than what we just saw in a game? Welcome to the Piccolo, where everything's better. Everything's better at
at the pickle. Everything's better at the pickle. I mean, 11 0. Two timeouts. Zero, zero. One of the quickest games I've ever seen on a pickleball court. Point. First point for Leia Jansen. Remember, these two players have played together in Major League Pickleball. They know each other's games exceptionally well. Already a better start here for Jansen. One zero. Forehand is oh, just ripping right now. It's huge. And some of those mistress turns you see from Leia Jansen is because if you leave a short of a turn like that, that forehand's coming by in a second. Two, one. There, I like that cat and mouse from Leia. Like we said, a luck, a little luck never hurt anybody. If you're Leia, do you keep trying to just establish your game? Any adjustments at this point? Just, and, I mean, too many errors. If you look at the the error count right now, very low from Annalie Waters, quite high from Jansen. But again, I like her coming forward. Game one, she didn't come forward at all in the return of staying back. Game two, a little bit better about imposing herself. It's going to make Anna Lee hit a target. She doesn't hit it perfectly. Points like that are going to happen. One, three. Shots like that, you just can't defend. Not at all. But again, like. We saw yesterday with Ben Johns and Kwong Duong. You, all you got to do, look, down 6-4, it went to 9-4, five straight points. Ben Johns said, all right, two good, five straight winners. That's all you can do. Put yourself in the best position. If the opponent hits a better shot, two good, on the next. Much better discipline there from Jansen coming forward, playing within herself. One, three. Yeah. Oh. Both sides get a little luck of the net there. But again, if you're Leia Jansen, you're making Annalie work for that point there. That's a positive point. Three, one. Side out. Who's out? First error on a serve. And now side out to Jansen. It's just nasty. Nasty. And so much power, easy power from Annalie Waters. Getting that paddle out in front. Easy through the back of that ball. She's got so much confidence in her shot making here thus far. Point. 
That is unbelievable, that roll. That thing is dipping as soon as it gets over the net. Annalie Waters, 17 years old. Leia Jansen, as we mentioned, 31 years old. Big gap there. Leia played college tennis, Washington State. Yep. Was an accountant briefly. And it came from a family of tennis players yeah. as well. Great Beautiful. ball there. Great ball. Forcing Annalie to move forward, not just side to side. Yeah, Leia's sister Maya played at Alabama, won a national title in doubles. Aaron Routliff, who's still on tour. How does she do it? My thoughts exactly, Drew. What an unbelievable pass, just dipping deep in the corner there. So much rotation. Even that last point, Annalise standing way over to the right on that serve, getting an angle, moving all the way over to the left, surrounding that ball and still finding the open space. Great mover. It's 5-1. Water's starting to pull away. Her shot making right now is just off the charts. Off the charts. Our outdoors to indoors to outdoors again. Fantastic work. Just one after the other. Yeah, highest 78 degrees with a chance of maybe 78 winners from Annalie Waters. I mean, this is out of control. Just the pace control, height control on these passes. Super impressive. Seven one. Point. Long from Jansen, now 8-1. Matt Leia has played much better in game two than she did in game one, but the results on the scoreboard just don't show. Yeah, and I think now frustration is definitely setting in these last few points. Don't see the same Nine vigor one. from her. Understandably so. Side Lee hits wide and perhaps the last window of opportunity here. Yep. I mean, Leia's come forward on some pretty good shots, forcing Anna Lee in the corners. Anna Lee up to the task every time with some great passing shots. Here, Mom Lee saying, close it out. Not just yet, says Leia Jansen. When you think of all the players on the Carvana PPA Tour, I don't think anybody puts in as much blood, sweat, and tears as Leia Jansen. Oh, yeah. Way more fit now as well, as opposed to six, 12 months ago. Point. Yeah, just a little wide. Great point. Again, even if you don't win this match, right, which is looking unlikely for Leia Jansen, get some points here, some positivity for the next event, for the next time you play Annalie. Find something here that works. 2 9. Just right wide from Jansen. And now we're at match, match point. point. Ten two. Anna Lee Waters looking unbeatable on semifinal Saturday. Now one win away from a singles championship here at the Vizzy Hard Seltzer Atlanta Open. 
how would you rate <laughs> the performance that we just saw? Because from our angle, it can't get much better than that. Yeah, I mean, I think the only thing I would say to myself is don't miss a return at 0-0 in the second game. But other than that, I think it was one of the more solid singles matches I've been playing. It's funny because when there, there's been a lot of rain delays recently and they keep re-showing the match that I played Lay on Texas where it went to three and I was down and then came back and won. And I was like, Annalie, all right, I've seen this enough. I'm going to go out there and I'm going to win easier this time. So coming out here mm -hmm. today, I really just wanted to show my best stuff um, and not make it as close as that, that match that we played. <laughs> You certainly won easier. Annalie, you're into the final tomorrow. Paris Todd or Salome Davidze. Are you going to watch that match a bit, a bit later on? And what challenges do those two bring for Championship Sunday? Yeah, I'll probably watch that match. I'm doing a Fila talk over there. So if anybody wants to go over there uh, next, I'll be doing a Fila talk over there. But <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to, to face a new opponent in the final. I feel like Catherine and I have been battling out all year. Uh, it was tough to see her lose to Paris. But um, yeah, coming in, I think, I think it'll be interesting. I haven't played Paris in a while. I think it was Nationals a year or two ago that I played her last. And Salome, I haven't played either. I feel like she's been kind of going to the tournaments that I've been skipping. So yeah, it'll be, it'll be fun and interesting to play that final. And Annalie, you've got your mom and dad with you practically every step of the way. Uh, how nice is it to have them in Camp Waters tournament to tournament? Yeah, it's amazing. I mean, they do so much for me. I'm so thankful to have them. Uh, I also have Mr. Scott here with me. He drives our bus around and helps me at the tournaments with stuff. So just having those people, I mean, it's definitely an advantage. There's stuff I don't even have to worry about, think about. Uh, my mom's there on the sidelines to get me out of the crazy talk and get me back focused in on the match <laughs> and tell me some strategy. My dad's there, I don't know, second bodyguard, kind of... This, this, is, this doesn't sound mean. He likes doing this, but he gets my water a lot. So I'm very thankful for that <laughs> if I run out. Um, but yeah, no, props to them. I love them. They've been amazing. I think they've raised me pretty well. So, yep, super happy to have them here.